Namaskar everyone. My name is Krishna Priya and I am from class 7E. Today, I am going to tell you some interesting things on a very unique topic, which is Similarities and differences between soil type in Rajasthan and Assam and the methods used here for conservation of soil as well. For conservation of soil as well. So let's get started. So before we get started with this topic, we need to know what is soil because this topic is mainly around soil. So what do you understand by soil? Soil is just a mixture of organic matter, minerals, gases, liquids and organisms which together support life. Now let's move further to our topic that is soil types found in Assam and Rajasthan. So the soil which is found in Rajasthan can be broadly divided into eight main categories and the soil found in Assam can be broadly divided into four main categories. Let's know these categories. So the soil of Rajasthan is divided into eight categories as mentioned earlier as well which are desert soil, brown soil, red loams, saline sodic soil, dune and associated soils, cerisms, hill soils which are also known as lithosols and alluvial soils and black soils. Now, do you know the soils found in Assam? They are alluvial soil, lateric soil, pediment soil and hill soil. Hill soil, we should remember that it was also found in Rajasthan. Now, let's move further to our second topic that is methods of soil conservation. Why do we need to conserve soil? We need to conserve soil because at many places which are left barren through many means like wind, the soil gets flown away and that is why it creates a great difficulty. That is why it is very important to know what are the methods of soil conservation. So the methods adopted by the state of Assam to conserve soil are as follows. They are gully control project which is being run in Assam. The next is field band or agrill project. Water harvesting cum water distribution project is also being followed there in Assam and counter trench is a very famously known project which is being run by Assam to conserve the soil there. Do you know which are the means or projects adopted by Rajasthan? Before that, we forgot to watch the pictures of the means adopted by Assam. So as you can see here, the picture of a place where there is a soil conservation project being run. There is a board over there, Government of Assam Soil Conservation Department. And it is very important to, and surprising to know that in these projects, the cost to run these projects is very high. Like in this board, as you all can read, estimated cost is 50 lakh. Like this, a huge amount of money is spent on these projects because soil conservation is a very important task. The other two pictures are of other projects adopted by Assam. And now let's move on to our next topic that is methods of soil cons conservation in Rajasthan. So I have listed these four main topics or the projects which are adopted by Rajasthan which are intercropping, Terrace farming, as we all know, on a hill they, uh, they do farming, then dry farming and shelter belts. Now, you know what's the next? So, as we have come here to the end of our presentation, at the end, I would like to conclude that let's revise what we have learned today. First, we learned what is soil. So, soil is nothing but a mixture of various minerals, rocks and living organisms which together form to combine and they support life and next we had learned that the soil of Rajasthan can be broadly divided into eight main categories and the soil of Assam is broadly divided into four main categories. Next we learned how 
the various methods of soil conservation are practiced in Assam and Rajasthan. So hope you like my topic. Thank you.